big uh, yes to respond to your question. Uh, today, at a press conference about jobs that we held, I announced several initiatives on our local food economy. As a businessman, it's been interesting to me. I've never seen anything where there's so much demand for a product but so little supply as to local foods. Whether it be farmers markets, whether it be to institutions, schools, etc., people want more local foods. And here in Kentucky, we've got a unique competitive advantage. We've got an agricultural base, we've got a foodie city, We've got great independent restaurants. So this is an area that I'm calling on local to be the national leader in the world in a local food economy. Today I announced that I would create something called life zones, local food economy zones, in areas of town where we need local foods. And model of partnership, model of program after Paducah's Lower Town Arts Project, where we would recruit urban farmers to come to the parts of town, give them a no interest loan on their house, for them to create urban farms uh, in our community. Last farmers markets need to work so that they accept electronic benefit transfers and food stamps. Thank you. I like that answer. <laughs> and yes, we have to be just that intentional about this because it is in fact a big deal and it has to do with our relationship to the city to our surrounding counties. It has to do with our relationship to land use choices and consumption of agricultural lands nearby to places. And it also happens to have a whole lot to do with our reinvestment in our inner urban neighborhoods because there are all sorts of opportunities for urban agriculture. We've seen some uh, fantastic examples of that that have been modeled um, for us by other cities and incorporated here in our own city. And once again, that choice of how we use the land to grow the things that people and citizens need actually happens to be the very thing that keeps the land open to be able to absorb the waters from the rains. It impacts a whole host of other issues with the pollution in our community. And so I think uh, if we continue to think things through in an integrated fashion, um, you can see benefits all the way across the spectrum. And so in fact, providing uh, incentives the local food is a very important idea. <laughs>